role as the tour leader. Uh, I work with the other two uh, tour officials and we, we look after the tour group. Um, we get them all organised, we, we look after them throughout the event and we go through the stage at the head of the uh, tour group and set, this, set the uh, pace for the tour group. Lead, lead car's a bit slow, that's all, you know, so we, we're sort of stuck behind him. Tour group are made up of people who have got special cars and it's an opportunity for people with their special cars to come on the tour, bring their cars and drive them as they're supposed to have been driven, as they've been designed to be driven on a closed road in a nice safe environment on the wrong side of the road using the whole road at speeds um, over the speed limit which is something you can't do on the normal open road and use these cars like they're really designed to be used. Oh it's been fantastic, yeah. yeah. A little bit slippery, a little bit wet to start with but as the road's dried out it's got faster which is good. We've got Porsches, Lamborghini, Audis, Jaguar, um, there's a whole array of spectacular cars. We're um, restricted to 160 kilometres now. Uh, we wear all wear helmets in the vehicles. The vehicles are all checked before they go. They have to have certain safety equipment in them. Um, and the, it's very well managed, the, the tour. We stay in a group, um, so the vehicles are all kept together. The Targa event itself and the Targa tour is fantastic fun. They're a great opportunity for people to go out and enjoy their vehicles. Have a great time, a lot of camaraderie, a lot of, a lot of uh, friends are made on Targa. The uh, tour especially is a chance for people that perhaps don't want to buy a race car, haven't got the, um, the time and effort um, to buy a fully fledged race car but can still go out and have a whole lot of fun and uh, drive their cars in a, in some, around some spectacular countryside, meet some awesome people and uh, have a whole lot of fun.